What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up, Sunseeds? What's up? This your girl, Mystic Sunflower. I'm back to do a collective general energy reading for all signs. What's up, Sunseeds? What's up? Thank you guys for all your likes, shares, subscribes, donations. Thank you guys. I appreciate every last one of you guys. Let's pull some cards. Let's see what Spirit wants you guys to know. What's up, Sunseeds? Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Divine. My ancestors are the highest white light. My holy angels. Archangel Michael, please protect me while I channel the energies for my collective sun seeds. Please and thank you. Anything other than the highest white light, please close that door. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, can I have some messages? Please. Can I have some messages for my collective sun seeds? What is the current energy? Please and thank you. Okay, so the first card out we have is Knight of Swords. Thank you, Holy Spirit. We have the Seven of Wands. Okay, so somebody could be trying to come in, okay? Um, with the Seven of Wands, Spirit is definitely blocking this person out with the higher friend, okay? So Spirit is blocking someone out, okay? Somebody could be want to come in and have a new beginning with you, invest in you. Yes. Okay. So it could be a union that um that's um that's like in the baking to come in right now. Okay. But with the seven of wands, spirit is blocking it. Something is being blocked. Okay. Somebody could be going through a spiritual lesson at this time. Holy Spirit, can I have some more messages? Or someone could be upset right now that wants to come in towards you, but they feel like you got them blocked. Holy Spirit, can I have some more messages, please, and thank you? Yeah, we had the Knight of Wands, and we had the Wheel of Fortune. Okay? So, Spirit is blocking whoever this person is. This person could be someone that's very flighty, very in and out. Okay? This could be someone that thinks with just a wand. Okay? Spirit, give me some more messages, please, and thank you. See, spirit see things in this um things happen in the spiritual realm first before it um it happens in the physical. Okay, so spirit spirit can see something with this person and spirit is blocking this person out, okay? Because spirit could know that this person's intentions is not real, right? Yes, we have the two of wands. Two of wands is all about making uh, wise decisions. With the will of fortune, something is changing. Um, I feel like spirit wants this person to um to make better decisions, make better choices with the Knight of Cups. Somebody wants to come in and offer you something, but I feel like spirit feels like this person is just not ready. It's three knights out here, okay? It's three knights. Somebody's still not somebody still has some more growing to do, okay? Something Somebody has something that they need to change, okay? Somebody needs to make better um, choices. And with this Knight of Cups, Spirit is just not letting this person come in right now to give you this offering because this person is just not ready. Yeah, we have the Five of Cups, okay? Somebody could be very sad at this time, okay? Somebody could be sad about a third-party situation they put you in with the Nine of Pentacles, okay? Somebody sees you as a Nine of Pentacles, very fruitful, very independent, and this person wants to come towards you, but um, this person could be wanting to come towards you for the wrong reasons, and spirit is blocking them out with the seven of wands, because something in this person, uh, with the will of fortune, something is changing, something is changing in this person's life, and I feel like spirit with the two of wands, spirit wants this person to make wise decisions, okay, this could be your divine counterpart with the knight of cups, but spirit feels like this person needs more growing to do, spirit, give me a card on this knight of wands, please, and thank you. Yeah, we have the Three of Pentacles. This is somebody that wants to work with you. This person wants to come in, collab with you, okay? I'm sorry for that noise outside. Somebody definitely wants to um, wants to work with you. Spirit, what's it, uh, give me a card on this Three of Pentacles. And it's Nine of Pentacles. Somebody, 
somebody sees you as single very beautiful got a lot going on for yourself right now and they and they are watching you and they want to come in they want to come in quick but spirit is blocking it because spirit is saying this person um needs some more growing to do okay this person's still a knight but whoever this person is this is your divine counterpart okay somebody is sad about a third party situation that they um could have put you in okay and somebody just watching you do your thing and be fruitful by yourself okay Spirit is changing something in this person like a spirit wants this person to make better decisions. Okay? Spirit is not letting this person come to you if they want some night energy where they're gonna be in and out. Yeah, we have the death card. Something is definitely ended in this person's life. Spirit wants this person to go through a transformation. Okay? Something is changing. Okay? And it's for this person highest good, okay? And spirit is just protecting you with the seven of wands, okay? Yeah, because we have the nine of wands with the seven of swords under the bottom, okay? This person could be having bad headaches. This person could be sick, okay? Mentally, physically. Or they could just be just... It's something in this person that needs to heal. This person could be suffering from some type of trauma, Okay, this person could be also a narcissist. Okay, but this person needs some more growing to do. So the person needs more growing. Spirit, clarify this death card. Something is definitely ending out this person's life. So this person could grow. Ace of Swords. Spirit said that's the damn truth. Ace of Swords. Spirit said that's the damn truth. Yes. The Emperor and the Moon card. Okay, because there's some type of secrets that you just don't. Oh, let me close that window so I see. I'm so far. It's some that was a trash um truck. This person needs to empty out some type of trash, some type of baggage that they have with them with the emperor in the moon card. This person is hiding something. Page of swords. This person could be watching you, trying to gather up some information, okay, seeing how they could come in, but they can't because spirit is blocking them. Okay, spirit is blocking this person. Spirit clarify. Yeah, page of swords flew right back out. This person is definitely watching you peek me. Okay. This person could be um, messaging you or trying to message you. This person also could be looking for you. If you got this person blocked, this person could be trying to hit you from other numbers. Looking at, looking for a way to contact you. Okay? This person also could be asking other people information about you. How to get in touch with you. Okay? With this not a pinnacle, three of pinnacles. Somebody definitely wants to work with you. But I feel like this person had you in a third party situation. Okay? And spirit is blocking them. You are divine. You are being the... Um, Protected by the, the divine, okay? Spirit wants something to change in this person's life with the Wheel of Fortune and Two of Wands. Something is changing so this person can make better decisions, okay? It's something, this person needs to grow up. It's too many nights, okay? This person is supposed to be an emperor, okay? Operating out of an emperor energy. This person has some growing to do. Yeah, we have the lovers, Okay? Spirit with the two of swords. Spirit is blocking this person out with the five of wands. It's some type of drama that you don't know. Um, you don't know that's going going on with this person. Spirit, give me a card on this. The, uh, what's the moon? What's the moon? What's the secret? This person could be trying to come in and, and manipulate a situation with you. And spirit knows that. Okay? Spirit is like, no, we're not doing that this time. Yeah. Ten of cups. The moon card was clarified with the ten of cups. This person could have gave it, um, offered a commitment somewhere else behind your back and you didn't know about it with the Ten of Cups. The Ten of Cups is a family. The Ten of Cups is all about um, wish fulfillment. The ultimate wish fulfillment. Having everything that you could possibly want and more. But it was clarified with the Moon card. Okay, this person definitely um, can have another situation going on. And this person wants to come towards you and work with you because they see you being so fruitful. Um, pre-empress on your own okay and spirit is just not letting this person gonna spirit is not gonna let this person come in and distract you with this night energy okay spirit is gonna change something in this person's life so this person you hear that that's confirmation spirit is gonna change something in this person's life so this person can grow up okay because this person's supposed to be an emperor okay with the death card something is definitely changing in this person's life okay yeah Definitely could be a twin flame or a high level soulmate. 
Give me another card on the moon and the ten of cups, Holy Spirit, please and thank you. Oh, that's a lot. So, again, it's a lot going on with this person. Okay? We have the King of Cups and the Eight of Cups. Okay? So, you could be dealing with a water sign, but somebody is trying to walk... Um, somebody is... Somebody is walking away from a situation with a magician. This person could also be trying to manipulate um, a situation as well. Okay. Somebody could be trying to do, see a spirit, see somebody doing something very sneaky. It's like somebody's trying to creep away at nighttime or at night and come towards you in this night energy. And spirit like, uh-uh, you're not doing that. You're not going to knock my divine being off their path because you still have immature ways about you that you need to do some healing. So with this wheel of fortune being here, spirit is saying you just, something needs to change in your life. You need to make better decisions. And with this death card, it's going to put this person in a um, in a, um, on a transformation. Okay, something is going to end out of this person's life. What is this? Um, what is this? King of Cups, Eight of Cups, and a Magician, Holy Spirit. This person have a lot. So this person has a lot of feelings for you, but it's something I feel like this person is um, but manipulating. Okay, what is this magician? Yeah, nine of swords. Somebody is up all night in their head because whatever they try to do is it, is is not working because spirit is blocking it. Spirit is blocking this connection. Yeah, the shrimp card and the two of cups. Yeah, you yeah. Somebody is holding back. Okay, somebody is definitely holding back. Yeah, something with the magician and an honest sword, somebody in the head, because whatever they tried to manipulate, whatever situation they, they whatever they tried to do, it didn't work. And somebody is wondering, like, well, how, you know, how did, and how, how, um, how, cause, how come somebody could be, they throat shocker, somebody, somebody throat, um, shocker is messed up. Somebody wants to speak to you. With this page of swords, somebody could definitely be looking for you, trying to message you. But somebody, like, how, how didn't it work? Okay, whatever they try to manipulate, it just didn't work. Because with the seven of wands, spirit is blocking it, and somebody is angry. Okay, because somebody wants to come towards you, but they can't because they they still in this night energy. Spirit, give me a yeah with the um yeah the lovers and the two of swords is being blocked. Okay, because it's a lot of drama that's going on around, and you are protected by the Most High. Spirit just not letting it go down like that. Okay. Yeah. The hangman. Okay. This is someone getting enlightenment. Seven of cups. Okay. That somebody, this person could have options. Okay. I'm trying to paint some type of illusions. Okay. This person has some options that they are not telling you about. With the six of swords, spirit is trying to make this, just guide this person away from these options to make better decisions, to grow up because this person has the potential of being an emperor. This person does have feelings for you, sun sees, but spirit sees what you don't see. So spirit is blocking this person out. Okay. Yeah. It's a lot going on. Spirit, give me, um, give me a card on this, um. On his lovers and two of swords, please and thank you. Yeah, I can't make it up. The high friend. Spirit is spirit is showing this person um giving this showing this person a spiritual lesson. Spirit is blocking this. God divine see everything that you don't see. Yes, the high priestess. Okay. It's a lot going on in secret that you don't see, and spirit is just blocking that blocking it out just for your protection at this time. So this person can do better. Let's pull for them. Um I pull a card for the message um, oracle before I close this out. Yeah. So a situation needs more balance, okay? Yeah. We have balance and true love. This person is your true love, okay? But spirit, spirit see things, okay? Yeah. Soulmate. Holy Spirit, give me a card. Give me some cards. Yeah, healing. What did I say? What did I say? Healing and forgiveness. Okay. This person needs to release whatever, whatever, whatever things, whatever toxic ways they have about them. With this hangman and seven of cups, whatever's keeping them stuck, whatever options that they have, 
they need to clear that out before they could come to you. Their spirit is not going to let this person come to you with, with all of this going on. You are too protected by the most high, the higher friend. Okay, spirit is, is definitely teaching this person a spiritual lesson. With this will of fortune, something is changing. To a wants, somebody has to make better decisions. Okay, because they they showing up with all of these nights, but spirit is saying this person is a uh, is a divine being as well. But this person has to do this, some healing and release things that no longer serve them. This person can't come to you with no lies. Okay, somebody need to do some type of healing, and somebody is going to be asking for your forgiveness once this healing is done. Okay. Yeah, this is you setting up boundaries, okay, with abundance. Your, your abundance is being protected from the... I'm telling you, your abundance and everything that everything that you work so hard on is being protected by the most high. And somebody sees that and somebody see how how much you glown up, I'm hearing. You know, how glorified you are. And they want to come in and work with you. But Spirit's like, no, because you got hidden agendas, okay? Yeah, it's being blocked out. Your abundance but and boundaries and protect the spirit wants you to set boundaries, okay? Your abundance, okay, you every everything about you is protected, okay? It says you are safe and divinely guided. You are safe and divinely guided. This is spirit doing this, okay? And someone is obsession. Someone is someone in this connection is gripped by obsessive thoughts. Whoever this person is, that's why we have the Knight of Swords with the first card that's coming out. Somebody is definitely obsessing over this connection. And they angry because they want to come in. But they, they they blocked by the most high. Yeah, interference. Definitely a third party situation. Somebody need to close out. Somebody is longing for you. And the passion is definitely there. Okay? I hope this message helps someone. Give someone some type of clarity. Until we get up next time. I love you, Sunsees. Peace.